What's going on guys, Bobby here, and today we actually have a really, really cool video idea for you guys. So something I see a lot in the comments is, you know, you win a lot, you do really well, but you always have really, really good teammates. You know, I'm always stuck playing with randoms. I don't know if you could also go on win streaks with randoms, and to be honest, I don't know either. I don't know the skill of randoms. I never, ever, ever play with randoms. Maybe for like a duo showdown Starkey I will. But besides that, I never play with randoms. I always play with my close friends just because they're always available and I enjoy playing with them the most. But today what we're going to be trying to do is hop into every single mode. So Deathcap Cave we're going to be playing, Pit Stop, Backyard Bowl, and Cavern Churn all with randoms. And we're going to see if we can hopefully go 4-0, hopefully 3-1. That's the goal is just one of those two. So with that being said, let's start off going into Deathcap Cave. We're probably going to go a mid here so that we can control the gems and try and control the game. Let's hop into the first game and let's see what we can do. Okay, so here we go into the first game. We're going to be facing a really, like, good team comp. And we're going to be playing with a Jesse and a Tara. So hopefully this goes well. I'm playing a 908 Gene or a 906 Gene, one or the other. Um, I'm just in full carry mode. I thought, you know what, Brawler could I carry the hardest with? And, you know, I just I just thought, you know, there's no other Brawler that I can carry harder with other than Gene. So there is a Rosa in our spawn, which our team comp does really poorly against. So it looks like the Rosa is going to be able to pick up a kill on the Jesse. Luckily for us, though, we're able to keep this Rosa low, and we are going to be able to pick up that kill. Trying to bait the Tara super. We will be able to. Uh, hopefully our Tara can get the kill. Okay, he was able to pick it up. So our Jesse has a couple gems right now. Luckily for us, I don't think this Rosa is maxed, so this might give us a little bit of an easier time against him. Jesse got the Rosa to 4 health, but wasn't able to finish him off. I'm going to be able to pick up the kill over there on the uh poco we're gonna get solo sucked over here but nothing really is going to happen from that just gonna pull this tara over here and we just need one more gem uh so we're gonna get this rosa low i think i'm gonna have to prioritize killing the rosa over get over getting that last gem because we do not want a rosa behind us uh poco does miss the heal on rosa and i think our tara will go down maybe not wow he's oh okay okay he goes down but honestly we're in a pretty good spot right now we're chilling uh, we're able to pick up that kill, so again, we just got to watch out for this Rosa, but if we can get it right now, just try and get it low. Hopefully that Tara gets that pull. She was able to do so. Um, yeah, this wasn't too, too hard, to be honest. I mean, maybe I got good randoms, I'm not sure, but we were able to really well hold that, you know, hold down the fort in that game. Uh, they were not bad players, all six of them, base, or all five of them, almost over 600, except for that Poco on the other team. But yeah, they're pretty good players, so we're 1-0 so far. We're going to hop over into Brawl Ball, I believe it is, which I think is going to be our greatest challenge. Let's hop into it, and let's see if we can get a dub. Okay, so we're going to be solo queuing with a Frank now. And we're actually going to be facing a Frank, Shelly, and Bo, which is a pretty big counter to what we have. Um, I think my two teammates aren't max. So that's a little bit unfortunate. Uh, we should be able to take out the Shelly here. Okay, we are going to be able to. We're going to get a super off over here. Ourselves and the Frank, we're just going to stun each other. I'm going to go down, but luckily our Jesse was able to pick up that kill. So it looks like this opposing team is actually Russian, which is really interesting that we're facing people from EU, even though we have, we were just solo queuing in NA. Now let's see what we can do here. Their Shelly does have the ball. We're going to be able to get it really low. Come on, someone shoot it. Okay, they're able to shoot it. We're going to have, like, just, you know, leave this game into our own hands. We're not going to trust the randoms to win it for us. We're just going to walk up over here. Going to break this wall, hopefully stun the Shelly. We're going to be able to, and we're going to be able to get that first goal. So it's one to nothing for us so far. We're doing pretty well. Going to move over to this right side. Hopefully we can get our super off that shot. We are going to be able to, and we're going to be able to get two kills. The Nita super was baited, but hopefully that Nita passes us the ball. Come on, give me the ball. Okay, the Nita's not going to pass the ball. It is going to do it on its own. So I guess we're just going to try and get that triple stun. We are going to be able to do so. We're going to get the triple kill. A little bit of BM with that super. Putting the ball in the net. And that is going to end the game. So we're able to dominate two out of two games so far. We're basically able to put the randoms on our back. The level 7 Jesse. And the... Um, and, you know, the Nita. The Nita wasn't bad. And, you know, we're able to win two games. So let's hop over to, I think the mode is Heist. And let's see if we're going to be able to go 3-0 and in the 3v3 modes, which actually would be spectacular. Let's hop into it, and hopefully we can do it. Okay, so here we go into our Heist match. And we're going to be facing a pretty good team. I actually recognize them now. It's actually really funny. By accident, I queued up into Bravo with Primo. And we actually won inside, uh, like, 45 seconds with a level 3 tick in Bravo. So that was actually really cool that we were also able to carry that tick. 
But anyways, I think it's going to be a little bit hard in Heist, just because you can't carry it that hard in Heist, unless you're like a Colt or something, but our Colt is at 950. So we obviously can't pull that one out. So it looks like both of our teammates are on the safe, or at least going to be on the safe. Okay, we got to be able to pick up the kill over here on this Primo. We are going to be able to do so. We're going to close in on this Colt. We are going to be able to pick up that kill. So we did have some pretty good defense. They're lobbing bottles at the safe right now. I'm just going to fully heal up. Jump onto the safe right here. Gonna get the stun, get a few shots off, and we're going to be able to take out the safe. I don't think we got star player that game. Anthony the Barley did. But either way, we're technically 4-4, four and four, but for the video at least, we are 3-3. Three and three. We won all three 3v3 modes with complete randoms. I have no clue who these guys are. And actually, the other team had more trophies than us. So that's super, super cool wins. So we're gonna hop into probably the easiest, but for me, the most difficult to carry in the duo showdown. And hopefully... We get a good random that we can carry with, and let's just see what happens. Hopefully we can go 4-4 four and four and win the duo showdown game. Okay, so here we go into the final game, and we're going to be given a primo, which is really, really bad on this map. I don't know why this random is a primo. And you guys know, if you guys get a primo random, it is usually going to be an L, so this is a little bit scary. I'm going to help him out over here. We're going to be able to pick up that kill. So we have two gems so far, That's or two power-ups, sorry. So that's pretty good. I'm just going to chill over here, get this third box. So we're going to have three power-ups, which is pretty good. We're going to try our best to get some mines now. He's got to get our super. We should probably stay close to this Primo, since he is almost dead. Oh, we were able to actually three-piece that Daryl over there. I think I saved that Primo's life with that three-piece. So we're going to get close to this bull. Hopefully the Primo can take him out. I think he is going to be able to. So we have seven power-ups. We're looking pretty good at this point. We're definitely the strongest team. Hopefully this Shelly doesn't have Band-Aid. Come on. Okay, we're able to pick up that kill. So now we have nine. We're looking really, really good. Four teams left right now. We're kind of just chilling in the middle. Hopefully that Rico runs over my mines. Just going to go right towards this Daryl. We're going to be able to pick up the kill on the Daryl. And now we're going to have ten. So at this point, we're just in a really, really good position. I think our Rico or our Primo is going to go down. He is, but this puts the Rico in a really, really bad spot over here. He's super low. He's just in that gas. We're gonna be able to pick up that kill. We're gonna pick this one up, and I don't think this Daryl has any way of killing me. Oh no! I think he just killed me. Not gonna lie. Oh, but our Primo's gonna get up. Go Primo! And he's gonna be able to get the kill. So we just went from a really power position. We both had like 11 to a one-on-one -on -one showdown um, with the last team. Now, to be fair. I am really happy with how we did. Second place, I will take that any day. Um, but we're gonna go for that dub here. So let's figure out where the Shelly is first. Our Primo's kind of just chilling. Okay, so we're able to find the Shelly. Why is our Primo chilling? Just jump on him. What is our Primo doing? He's AFK. Our Primo has gone AFK. I think our Primo could have actually won the game if he jumped on the Shelly. But he decides to go AFK. Either way, we got positive. We got second. I'm counting that as a win. So we have gone 4 for 4 in this video with randoms. Carrying every single one. And, you know, honestly, this isn't meant to be a video where I'm like, just get good. Randoms aren't that bad. But to be honest, they really aren't. Um... If you guys can think of of playing like the right brawlers and just think strategically, as you saw, I always went to brawler which I can control the match with. And you guys play properly, you will be able to win with randoms almost every single time. So, anyways, GG's to the randoms that I played with. Maybe you guys are one of the people that watch my videos, and if so, congrats on playing with me. But um, but yeah, that's going to be it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'd be down to do another uh, type of video like this. It was really really fun and really um, really something new and something that was going to be unexpected for the entire time. So I had a lot of fun with it. That's going to be it for today. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to have another video guys, for you guys out tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will be back later. Peace.